So today we're going to make vegan bacon. So I've got my parchment paper, ingredients, we've got garlic powder. I've got a little bit of my Canadian maple syrup because they say you're supposed to use real maple syrup. I had some from Canada. Paprika, black pepper, nutritional yeast, olive oil, and soy sauce. Oh, I forgot. Liquid smoke, which I've had this forever and now I have a good reason to use it. And then we got rice paper. We're going to actually use this rice paper to make vegan bacon. This is going to be crazy. The More Movement Crew. So now I'm actually cutting the rice paper to make sheets of bacon. like a project in school. <laughs> the kids, like if this bacon actually turns out really good, your kids can help make your rice paper bacon. Oh, lost a piece. All right, so this is my pack of bacon. So we'll see how this turns out. So right now we have our four tablespoons of olive oil. We have our, I can open it, four tablespoons of nutritional yeast right here. Get that Kroger. Now we have soy sauce and we're going to do six tablespoons of this. Now we're gonna do one tablespoon of garlic powder. All right, maybe a little bit more. I like garlic. I just don't know about in bacon, but we'll see how this goes. So next we're gonna do half a teaspoon of this liquid smoke. All right, half a teaspoon. And then one tablespoon of maple syrup. I got this Canadian maple syrup, so we'll, we'll see. All right, there's my tablespoon. Next, half a teaspoon of black pepper. Seems like a lot of pepper, but we're gonna make it do what it do. Half teaspoon black pepper and also half a teaspoon of paprika. I'm kind of excited about this. I think that's the fun thing about being vegan is you get to experiment on stuff and like when it tastes good, you're like, wow. All right, so I'm just gonna stir it all up like this. And this is what we're gonna use to dip our bacon in. Well, our rice paper bacon, our fake and bacon. All right, so that's what it looks like. So now, this is the part that actually makes the bacon part. So, the instructions say to dip each piece in this mixture. So I'm dipping the bacon in the mixture and I'm sitting it on the parchment paper. And it says to double your strips. So. I'm gonna put two on top of each other because you want it to be thick and this rice paper is really thin. So I'm guessing it kind of gets a little um, fragile. So I'm gonna take two pieces and put them on top of each other like that. So I'm just gonna keep doing this until I have a whole pan of strips.
So now we're gonna put this in the oven for seven to eight minutes until it's crispy. So we'll see. I wanna show you how it's sizzling in the oven. <laughs> like real bacon, that's funny. It's been eight minutes in the oven and this is our bacon. I want to show you what it looks like after it comes out the oven. It kinda looks like this. Kinda looks like turkey bacon. Um, I didn't dip this in, so it's still kind of rice papery, but the color is like crazy. That part broke, but it looks kind of like bacon. Like it really does look like bacon. So, and you can see how it's like even bending like bacon. So now I have to taste it to see if it actually tastes like bacon. Then I'm going to put it, I made just a small like avocado spinach and veganaise sandwich so I can put it on there and see if it tastes better with the actual like mayo. So here it goes. So now we're gonna actually try this thing out. So here's the bacon right here. I'm gonna taste it. Crunches like bacon. Surprisingly, it's not as bad as I thought. I would like more maple. It's more salty than anything. You can taste the liquid smoke. And it's salty like bacon. But it's really good for like a not real, like it's not pork, but it's really good. Um, I would definitely douse my mixture in maple syrup next time. Like a ton of it so that it has that like sweet maple taste. But... Overall, this fake bacon ain't that bad. Now we're gonna try it with this sandwich. This is what it looks like on bread. It's my sandwich. Here it goes. You guys, this is my work. Like, it gives you the bacon crunch and it goes with the mayonnaise and the bread. So, like, I legit can eat this. Put some scrambled tofu. Excuse me. I'm talking about my mouth open. This could be legit breakfast. Facts. Not bad. There you have it. My rice paper vegan bacon. Try it. Let me know how it tastes. And if you liked it. Thanks for watching.